this is a simple circuit of an inductor which is connected across this voltage source V and the current through this uh, inductor in the circuit is I. Now, if we talk about uh, the phasor diagram of, of this circuit, then if I'm taking this voltage as a reference, uh, so the current will always lag this voltage by 90 degrees because this is the basic property of an inductor. A pure inductor, in a, in a pure inductor, the current will always lag the voltage by 90 degrees. Now, inductor always stores energy in its magnetic field, which is given by half Li square. Now, if you talk about the power that is stored in this uh, inductor, um, it is divided into two parts. One is reactive power and another one is active power. As the angle phi is 90 here, so uh, according to Vi sin phi, the Q means uh, reactive power becomes V into I and the active power becomes zero because the angle is 90, cos 90 is zero. So from this we can conclude that inductor never absorbs or delivers active power. It will only absorb or deliver reactive power if it is a pure inductor. Now, similarly, if we talk about a circuit which is having a capacitor connected across a voltage source V, this is V, and the current in the circuit is I. So again, I'm taking the voltage as the reference and there is a property of a capacitor then the current um, that the current that flows through this capacitor all, will always lag the voltage across it. So this is the voltage and this is the current which is leading the voltage by 90 degrees. And induct, oh sorry, uh, the capacitor will always store the energy in its electric field. Okay. Now this is given by half CV square. Now again the reactive power will be V into I because angle is again 90 degrees and the active power will be zero. So in case of a capacitor also it uh, never consumes or delivers active power. It will only consume or deliver reactive power. Now, suppose this is an inductor which is connected across a voltage source V. L. Now, if I assume that uh, the current is flowing in this direction, that means the inductor is absorbing the power. It, it, is, it is storing the energy in its magnetic field. So, we can say that uh, this inductor is absorbing lagging watts because we know that in this case, when the, uh, the current is in this direction, the inductor will, inductor will absorb the energy. So it is, we can say that it is absorbing lagging wars. This is the unit for reactive power, Vi wars, volt ampere reactive. Now, when the inductor starts discharging through this source, the direction of the current will reverse. That means in this phasor diagram, this current, current direction will reverse. That means now in this case, the current will lead the voltage. Let me draw this here. This is voltage V reference. This is current I. I have drawn this uh, in this direction because the direction of the current is reversed. Now, in this case, we can say that it is delivering the power. It is delivering the energy, but in opposite direction. And uh, we can say that it is delivering leading wars. Why leading wars? Because the current is leading the voltage. Now, 
Similarly, for a capacitor, suppose this is a capacitor and it is uh, connected across a voltage source and it is absorbing the energy. This is current I C. Okay. Now, again, according to this phasor diagram, it is absorbing the energy and current is leading the voltage. So, it is absorbing leading watts. Now, in the next case, when the capacitor will uh, discharge through this uh, voltage source, the direction of current will reverse. Now, what, happen what is happening? This current direction is reversed, so the phasor diagram will be like this. Previously, it was uh, in this direction now it is in opposite direction this is voltage reference always this is 90 degrees this is current i so in this case i can say that it is delivering because the direction of the current is towards the source so it is delivering lagging words So these are some basic concepts about uh, an inductor and a capacitor when they are connected across a voltage source. Thank you.